everybody it's me and I'm going to be talking about the uses of Mac Fix Plus and how I use them and how you can use them and for the people who do not know what is Fix Plus Fix, Fix Plus <clears throat> is like a refreshing mist that you can spray in your face or use for other eyeshadows or other purposes that you wish to wish to use it for so it's a multi-purpose you know product that Mac sells now, I have, the, they say was the limited edition, the lavender scented kind. This So this one smells a little bit different than the original. So if you know, if you have the original, the regular kind of um, Fix Plus that they always sell, and then lavender, you know it smells a little bit different. I like them equally. I know the first time I first had this lavender mist, the version of Fix Plus, the lavender version, I didn't really like it. But it, I, it grew on me. So the ways that I use this is, you know, if you're familiar with my channel, um, I wear powder foundation, you know, like um, this on my face or wherever the other one is. Oh, the first one I showed was the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish and I wear dark or the MAC Studio Fix Powder in my color C8. And that's what I have on my skin today. I have both of those powders on. So after I applied that powder on my face, I just gave my face a light little spritz to get rid of that powdery look. And I just uploaded a, a, a updated foundation tutorial on what I do. And you can see that I had like a real powdery look. So once I sprayed this on and it set in, it kind of gives me this kind of look. Um... You know, I don't like a really matte look. I like a kind of natural, glowy look, if that's what you want to call it. So, you can use this after your foundation to set it. And also, you can use this to refresh your face. Um, I use it to refresh my face when I'm outside, maybe on a hot day. I carry this in my purse. And when I'm feeling, like, hot, I just kind of just put two pumps on my face. And, and it refreshes really good. Now... Another very, very popular way, if you are on YouTube a lot and you watch a lot of makeup gurus, they will use Fix Plus and they will spray it, for example, like on, on a brush. They'll go, they'll go like this, like, they'll do that. And this will help better control applying some shadows. And I'll actually show you really quick on how it works if you're not familiar so for example I'm going to take a I keep nicking all my MAC shadows you guys because of my nails and I just did it just now crappers so this is a MAC shadow and this one is called woodwinked so I sprayed my brush no actually I'm going to dip this in here first and I have a lot of product on there. So now I'm going to spray it with Fix Plus. And now it's a wet product. So now when I put it on my hand. I don't know if it's going to show up. It shows up very, very more vibrant than it would before. It gives it a foiled look because it's a wet product now. So that is what it looks like. Hopefully you can see it. So you can use this product to spray your eyeshadows with to enhance the color on your lid and to help better control maybe using pigments and pigments are loose eyeshadow powder forms. So that's what Fix Plus also is used to better help control you applying your shadow and controls fallout or to better enhance a color like I did with this a shadow. So I don't know if it's really showing up, but it's gives you kind of like a foil look. Now, you can use that for any kind of eyeshadows like matte or whatever shadows you want to use. Um, I also use this after I wash my face with my um, oil-free acne wash by Neutrogena. And this is the um, pink grapefruit kind. And this was the Allure Reader's Choice of 2009. And I just love this stuff. It smells really good. It does the same um, exact thing as the original scent of the oil acne free wash. So I wash my face with that and then I'll spray my face with Fix Plus just all over. And I spray my face to get it like really wet. 
and then I'll apply my um, oil free um, moisturizer and this one is bought for sensitive skin so that's what I use on my face and I just really massage it in it just makes my face feel really good and you know lavender is an essential oil so that may have some calming effects to your skin and also the scent is calming too so um, that is some of my uses or the ways you can use it um, use Fix Plus and if you guys have any other ideas of how you use your Fix Plus you can put it down in the bottom bar and I will put um, um, other information about this product in the bottom bar now I will say if you do not want to spend $14 on this which I think is well worth it because I love this stuff <coughs> excuse me oh I need some water you can use the um the other uh it's a drugstore product called Evian and it's the same kind of mist that you can get and it's much much cheaper if you are just starting out with makeup or on a budget. But um this stuff lasts me a long time. I don't use this often, so fourteen dollars was really worth it to me. Um also you can always make your own kind of um fix plus with glycerin and water and add your own lavender in there. Um but also other makeup brands sell a sell these kind of finishing mists. You don't have to just buy MAC Fix Plus. There's a whole bunch of other brands that um, sell a a mist, um, a finishing mist that you can buy. So, um, but the one that's the most cheap that you can pick up at any drugstore is the Evian brand. And I think I might pick it up myself to compare the differences or the, you know, the similarities or differences of these two products but I just wanted to share really quick because I know I got a lot of questions some people don't know what fix plus is and all at one at one time we all didn't know what fix plus was so if you have any other questions um, I'll put this down in the bottom bar and I also will put a link down to the Mac website um, to this product that you guys can check out and I personally bought this myself so um, I love this stuff it's my best friend so if you have any other questions, you can put that down in the bottom bar.